Hey, what's up everybody? This is Ryan Scher with PCDJ. Uh, I'm going to show you a little bit about how to update playlists uh, that you've already imported into the library or have already created a playlist from a folder on your drive using the Explorer view and the software uh, or updating the database, the global database in the program. Uh, this video applies to either DEX 2.0 or Red Mobile 2. Uh, the library functionality is the same. Uh, so feel free to follow along. So we've got, uh, right now I've got my DJ promo music folder here. This is a list that I've previously generated from a folder on my drive. Okay, so for instance, I've, I updated this or I created this, uh, this playlist from a folder on my drive yesterday. Okay, today, to that same folder on the drive, I've added a few more songs. We'll open up that folder right here so you can see. So I've added all these songs. Actually, we'll say for, for the sake of the video here, I've just added uh, uh, these top eight or so songs. Uh, my math is horrible. That's ten songs up here up top. And uh, I wanted to update the library accordingly. You know, I wanted to add these songs in. So one way to do it is just open up the Explorer view, open up the folder on the drive, highlight these songs. Now, you can just highlight one at a time and drag them and drop them in and it will populate. Uh, or you can hold down the uh, the control key on your keyboard, select that one, select this one, and select these top 10. After they're highlighted, simply click on one of them, drag them in, and drop them. Now that would just populate with those new songs. So that's one way to do it. Of course, in this regard, you would have to know what songs have been added to the folder on the drive. You'd have to know, okay, I've added these 10, these are the 10 that I want to throw in there. Uh, so you can just go to that folder and drag and drop them in. Uh, I think a much simpler way to do things would be to uh, simply go to this folder, you know, the list actually you've previously created, right click on it, delete the playlist. Do you want to delete this? Sure. See ya. Now from the Explorer view down here, the Explorer view in the library, navigate back to that folder on the drive. Um, alphabetical eyes here. Okay, so we got DJ promo music. If you just highlight it, right click on it, okay? Just say new playlist from folder again. So it's gonna tell you a new playlist was created based on the selected folder, hit okay. And so you'll now find this under your playlists here. And that's gonna show you all the old songs that were in there previous to yesterday and all the new songs that I've added yesterday. Uh, so that's gonna be updated accordingly with everything. So those are probably the two best ways to do it uh, in, uh, in my opinion. Uh, you also have your global database. Now the database uh, is used for all your content. Everything you have in your playlist, everything you have, uh, all the content on your drive, whether it be audio, video, karaoke, you want to add to the global database. And, and the reason for that uh, is usually because you want to search everything at once. Um, you know, if you want to search just a list, you enter that playlist and do a search there. It's going to find only what's in that list. Uh, but if you want to search your entire drive or all the content you have, you want to add it to the database. So to update the database, uh, same thing applies. You can open up Explorer, like I did before, and just drag files into it. Um, or you could actually, you know, if I previously generated a playlist on the folder, I could just click here and drag the song up into the database. So if I've imported a folder from the drive, uh, and made it a playlist, I can drag right out of that and drop into the database. So I can drop this entire list, hold down shift on your keyboard, highlight the top track, go all the way to the bottom of the list, highlight the bottom track, drag everything into the database and populate it with the new stuff. Or another way to do it would be, as I showed you before, open up the Explorer view on your drive, drag the files out of there one at a time, or you know, hold down control, select multiples and drag them in. Uh, another would be if you added a whole other folder to the drive, simply go back to the Explorer view at the bottom here. Let's take DJ Promo Music for instance. Again, right click on it, add to database. Folder was added to the database. So bang, the database is now going to have all those songs in there that I had before. It's going to have everything that uh, you know I just newly added. Uh, and that's it. Uh, email us if you have any questions. That's your lesson for today, kitties. We'll see you around next time. Thanks.